fathers at the helm. And he arose, and rebuked the wind, and said unto the sea, Peace, be still. And the wind ceased, and there was a great calm. And he said unto them, Why are ye so fearful? And how is it that ye have no faith? Mark 4, 39 and 40. We live in days of uncertainty. Paul defined this span of history as perilous times. I can personally feel the storm of life raging all around. Gone are the calm, peaceful days of smooth sailing. These are the days of violent spiritual warfare. The sea of life is raging and waves are crashing over the boat. At times, Christians feel that their way of lives are in danger. But I have good news, my friend. God has everything under control. J.G. Pike believed with all his heart that God is at the wheel. He wrote, The Christian often finds the path to heaven most secure when most beset with thorns, and the sea of life safest when most stormy. Afflictions to the children of God prove to be the best mercies. The martyr's flames have often preceded the throne of heavenly joy, and the crown of thorns has been the forerunner to a crown of glory. It has been said that on board a ship in the midst of a violent storm, when the mariners were in distress and alarm, one little boy remained composed, and being asked the cause of his composure, answered, My father is at the helm. So may the Christian say in every trial, My father, my almighty father, is at the helm, and he will steer me safe through every storm, or, when he pleases, say to the tempest, Peace, be still. Regardless of your present struggle, there remains a constant. God is in control. Take a moment right now and visualize your Heavenly Father at the helm. This devotional was taken from the Reverend Steve Hill's book, Daily Awakenings, and I pray you have a blessed day.